When I look into your eyes It comes as no surprise You're slipping away Angel, you're the love of my life It's so cold at night I'm begging you to stay guys it is thursday which means it's time for another video i just want to say thank you guys for not only voting on the poll um if you guys have not um kept up with my community tab uh this will be put out on thursday but i'm actually recording it um a day early but sadly a week ago we had to put my husband and i had to put our cat oreo down um still trying to like process that you know um a lot of people may think oh it's just an animal um but he was a very big important part of our lives um constantly always with us like I can never do anything without him there um if you have seen all my videos he was in a big chunk of my videos um a fellow subscriber slash good friend of mine Brad he made um my intros to my channel for my videos and he actually included Oreo in the intros because how much he was always just he loved this he loved the camera and if you have seen the Camp Stalker movies um Camp Stalker 2 he was actually in that for like a short scene just I, I wanted to include him in it because he was in he always loved to be on the camera um and it's very very hard um just trying to get over it not not I wouldn't say get over it but like try to get through it that's that's a better way of saying trying to get through it um it still stinks um so this is kind of like an update about my life slash um future of my collection because I also want to um, talk about my collection as well. But I wanted to talk a little bit about Oreo. So that if this is something that you guys don't really want to... I know this is not, not really horror related. I will begin to the horror later or in a little bit. But I just want to talk about the cat. And just let you guys know I am here. I'm doing okay. Um, not as much as I want to be. But I know like he's in a better place now. Um, a lot of tears... Still days where um cause he he was even would always lie with me every night that type of thing he'd lie with me I'd get home from work I would feed them and everything and then sit down on the couch he'd sit right with me he just loved to sit with me loved the attention loved being picked up loved being held I have in their cap but he's not as like he loves the attention don't get me wrong. But he doesn't like to be held. He's very skittish. And he's been like that since I've had him since he was a kitten. I mean, he's six now. So we're, we're trying to get through it. And it just really sucks. <laughs> um, I'm going to keep the post about um, Oreo on my community tab for a while. Um, just want to keep it up there so you guys can see him and... Um, like I said, if you guys watched my videos, he was always in my videos. There was actually a review I did one time where right in the beginning of the video, and I don't edit my videos. I don't have the fancy schmancy equipment to edit. I mean, I could tamper with editing. Like, I could try to do it, but I just haven't gotten around to doing it yet. So, like, I just, I just full on just go right through. Whatever happens, happens. And I remember doing a review... And the second I hit play, started talking, he wanted to be held. So I literally did the whole review, five and a half, six minutes, 
and I was holding Oreo the whole time. <laughs> so, like, he loved like, just interrupting videos, too. Interrupting live streams, interrupting videos. Um, so, he'll definitely be missed. But, like I said, I know he's in a better place now. He's not suffering anymore. Um, but, yeah, that's really what I wanted to say. Also, I do want to show this because I think it is so sweet. My brother-in-law, who's also um, direct, director of Camp Stalker with me, Camp Stalker Films, he, has, he just recently got a 3D printer and he made this 3D print of Oreo. And it is amazing. Um, absolutely love it. He's, it's on our um, shelf right now. With a couple of little Oreo hairs. Um, there's still Oreo hairs around the house too. Um, if you're a cat, if you're a cat lover and you have cats, you definitely know <laughs> what what that's like. Just cat hair everywhere. Um, but I also want to show you. Try, I'm trying to lighten the mood a little bit more because it's kind of a downer beginning video. Um, we decorate our house full of blow molds. If you're not familiar with what blow molds are, blow molds are um, decorations for like Halloween, Christmas, Easter, Thanksgiving, St. Patrick's Day, Valentine's Day, all those holidays. Um, they are basically like a plastic, it's a plastic, This these kinds are plastic, they're molded and made into Halloween decorations. And we have a lot in our uh, collection. And um, we actually just recently got two from a um we this past sunday we went to a halloween flea market um i bought this one because we have this one now um this red one right here right there and then over here let me see that we have a green one um we got those well the orange one i just got at the halloween flea market and then my husband and i we both delved into this big one so we all t only technically need one more haunted house blow mold. We have all of them because there's one right there as well. Um, we have a lot, but um, also there's more in the kitchen. <laughs> we have a lot. There, there's more blow molds. There's some up there, some right here, 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 um, up here, up there. We have a lot, um, and also, if you're probably wondering why there's tape on this freezer, um, Oreo used to, or <laughs> the one time I came home from work and Oreo opened up the freezer, uh, he must have jumped down and opened it in the process. So we, ever since we have put in we have put tape on the freezer and we had we're not stopping that anytime soon, because it's kind of like a memory of the cat. But yeah, there's some blow molds. And while we're in the um, topic of like Halloween ish, um, currently in the bedroom now, we're moving all the stuff. We're going to all the rooms. Um, my collection. Currently, um, I could technically put DVDs in the closet. Um, more towards, more for the Blu ray. It's not saying DVDs are bad. I know I, there's some DVDs that I have that I can't really upgrade to blue. Um, I don't really have room. <laughs> I, like I said, I could put DVDs in the closet. I'm not really with like bills and everything right now. I'm trying, I'm not buying anything right now. I, yeah, I pre-ordered that Hell House box set. That's the only thing I have bought even remotely recently. Um, there's a lot, there's not a lot of room at all. Like, I'll show you. Um. If you can see too from the thumbnail that I made, there is like studies right here are gonna be ones I'm selling, like Zombie Five, Intruder, Orca, Zombie Three, Zombie Night of the Living Dead remake. Those are all um ones that I obviously upgraded, and I'm gonna sell them for a little extra money. Um, yeah, there's not a whole lot of room though. Uh, <laughs> I'm not. I'm not. I'm not gonna like. <laughs> There's Marcus right there. Um, but I'm not going to quit uh, buying movies. Don't get me wrong. I'm just taking a break from now. So the movies on the polls are going to be down to the nitty gritty almost. Because I'm pretty much in like, uh, I think the 20, 20s almost. Um, 
of movies that I still own that I have not seen. So that's almost done. Which I guess this is a good thing, technically, because now I'm not buying all these new movies and then um, never seeing them. So then I have to put more movies on the poll. So I guess this is a good and bad at the same time. Like I said, I'm not done making uh, or done buying movies. Just Hell House and that's pretty much it. But I hope you guys enjoyed. I know the video is not very fun, but I just want to give you guys an update because I haven't posted in a week. Um, did not post on Thursday because Thursday was not a good day because that was the day that we said we had to put Oreo down. Monday, I just was not, I'm not gonna lie, I was not in the mood. Um, it's hard doing something when you have no ambition. I'm not saying I'm tired of doing the videos. I, I clearly am not tired of doing the videos. It's just when you get upset like that, it's it, it takes a toll on you. Um, you guys understand. I'm hopefully you guys understand. Um, but I just want to give you guys an update and um, let you guys know what's going on in my life. Um, but I will be doing a, the review of Cat People on Monday because that won the poll. I'm gonna just do that, and then after that review, I'm gonna put a new poll. Um, so definitely stay tuned for that. And in the meantime, I'll see you guys on Monday. But um, again, I just want to say thank you guys for the kind words and the support. Um, I really appreciate it. It definitely made things a little bit better, you know. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys on Monday.